My name is Lourdes Pinney and I play viola. I was three when I started violin, and I then switched to viola when I was around 10. And um, the reason I switched was because me and my sister always were competing against each other. I have an older sister who also plays violin, and um, she was always better than me, so I never liked the instrument at all. And then um, my teacher just told me that maybe it's like a good time to switch, so I just switched to viola because I didn't really care. But once I switched, I really fell in love with the instrument. I don't really listen to classical music. I know a lot of um, uh, musicians listen to classical music. And um, I kind of listen to more pop and maybe rap. So um, I really like Shawn Mendes and Sia. Um, I also really like Jacob Collier because um, just how, how complex his music is. started YAO, um, well I've always, I always knew of YAO. Um, I'm a senior now so it's kind of late in my um, high school career to join, but I always heard of it when I was like freshman throughout high school and um, it was because I always heard my friends around me playing the music. I always wanted to join but it never fit with my schedule and um, last year when everything really freed up because of Corona, I was able to um, just audition and see what would happen, but one of my friends recommended it to me. to go to college uh, for music so YO definitely has helped me um, just understand kind of what path I want to take first when I'm um, going to get a performance degree because there's many different paths you can take and I uh, realized that I want to do more of like um, string quartet and like um, chamber ensembles so that would include orchestra and being in YAO and experiencing all of that has helped me figure that out. The thing I enjoy most about being in YAO is probably just, well, being able to play with everyone. I've missed that since this year was kind of odd, but also I think being able to have like those personal experiences, like, um, Whenever Junior talks about his stories, they always make us laugh. And um, yeah, just being able to talk to my friends, it's a lot of fun. been in YAO for very long, but I think my favorite memory would be when we recorded um, in November for just um, a recording during everything. And um, I think just being able to kind of like carpool with my friends again, it kind of brought me back into what life was like before um, Corona hit. But yeah, I think 
and also I just love all of the um, just practicing every day with everyone. It's always a joy going to YEL. <laughs> I've actually, I've never done any of the YO competitions, but except for uh, like the two that happened over the last school year. But yeah, I really like, I like competing. Um, sometimes it's hard, it's very stressful. Um, but yeah, I do like it when you can kind of see all of like your hard work pay off hopefully, but it's definitely stressful and it helps me though um, kind of learn how to be mindful of like where my brain is at so um, like every time before I perform I always like meditate so I know like because I remember I I've done competitions for a long time and I always remember getting so shaky and then like my bow starts bouncing on my instrument um, so a really good way for me to calm down is when I like meditate and then I stop shaking, kind of just like focus on my breathing. And then when I'm up there, I always hear, cause there's so many amazing, um, there's always so many amazing musicians competing against me in these competitions. And I always have to just think to myself, like you can't, like, you can't compare yourself. That's not your job. You're just, the job you have is just to be up here and like play your best and like give it and play from your heart. That, yeah, that's what I try to focus on so I don't like compare and then freak out, but yeah. My dream work that I would love to play um, is with an orchestra, specifically is Scheherazade or um, any one of the movements of Piazzolla's, I think they're the um, the Spanish versions of Vivaldi pieces. I can't remember their actual names, but um, they're so pretty. And you need a soloist for both of those pieces, but I would love to play um, in the orchestra for those.